Counting down to first pitch at Rogers Center, the Rangers and the Blue Jays are next. MLB The Show welcomes you north of the border. We are in Toronto, Ontario, Canada, as we're set for Major League Baseball under the roof here at the Rogers Center. But first, let's take a look at our starting lineup here. It's presented by State Farm. Get to a better state, State Farm. And there you get a look at the starting pitcher whose job it'll be to keep these guys in check. His number is right there on the right side of your screen. Ian Kinsler makes his way to the plate now as 50 degrees at game time. Now a good change up there as this is lifted into the air out towards center field. Goss is in his tracks now and he's got it for the first out. Elvis Andrews will get his first shot here coming off a three hit ball. Now a swing and a ground ball. Throw gets him two down. Josh Hamilton will stand in for the first time now currently seventh in the American League in hitting. Now a swing and a ground ball for Escobar at shortstop. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. So a rather... Starting lineup for Toronto is put forth by manager John Farrell. Looks like this. And getting his final warm-up tosses in, the starter who they'll be up against, as you see his totals there on the right side of your screen. Anthony Goss will step in now to lead things off in the home half of the first. Fastball swung on and missed for the first out. Yunel Escobar will dig in here. And here's a fastball that he takes the other way out to fairly deep right. Under it is Cruz now for out number two. Jose Bautista will stride forth to take his first cuts now. Fastball was just a setup, so he can come back with that big curve. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and that is... Adrian Beltre will get his first opportunity here, and as you can see, he's got... Big swing there as it's hit pretty well out toward deep left field. Snyder is back, though, as he makes the catch on the track for the first out. Nelson Cruz will get his first shot. Now a slider that swung on and hit in the air out toward left. And two quick outs here in the second. Mitch Moreland will get his first opportunity now. Two for four to close out Sunday. Fastball and he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. And see you later, that one is gone. Mitch Moreland with a solo home run. Number 13 for him on the year. As the Rangers strike first, it's one to nothing. Michael Young will stand in. Swing and a ball headed towards the hole. Oh, a tough play. And a close play at the bag, but a good stretch by the first baseman got the out and the inning is over. Adam Lind will stand in to get it going for Toronto and he's got Travis Snyder. One two offering is hit in the air out to straightaway left. Murphy has him played perfectly as he puts it away for out number one. Travis Snyder will step in now. And now on two and one, this ball sent in the air out to straightaway left. Murphy is right there as he'll put it away without much problem for the second out. J. Pierre and Sibia will stand in here. One for four in Sunday's ball game would be next. Line to left. And the Blue Jays break into the hit column as that's a base hit. Mo Sierra will get his first opportunity now. Now a fastball as he just reared up and let that one fly and the inning is over. Mike Napoli will get his first opportunity here, and that average is certain. Well, maybe something to try and change the eye level there. 
And now I might anticipate another slider down in the zone, maybe even in the dirt. Snyder ranges deep into the corner to make the catch for the first down. David Mur Now he turns and smokes this one into deep center field. And he'll put it away now without much of a problem. Two gone now here in the third. Ian Kinsler will get a second crash. And a slider swung on and missed, and the side is retired. Kelly Johnson will stride in. He was one for three in the ballgame back on Sunday. Now a hard hit ball back up the middle. And a diving effort there from Kinsler, but it'll go for not a base hit. Number 15 will take his first cuts now. Now a swing and a high fly ball, and this one has some carry on it to deep right field. There to take it is Cruz, and that's the first out. Anthony Goss will stand in here. He was set down on strike. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Yunel Escobar will dig in here. He flew out his first time around. Off for second is Johnson. Pitches a cold strike. The throw is not in time as he just gets in ahead of the throw. Johnson, that's now 11 stolen bases for him on the campaign. Now a ball hit back up the middle. Oh, and it eats up Kinsler. Jose Bautista will stride in again. He struck out swinging his first time. In a hard place here. If you go ahead and walk him, you're loading the bases for your cleanup hitter. What a stop by Kinsler. Throw on to first is in time, and the Toronto rally goes for naught as the inning is over. Blue Jays leave a pair. Here's Elvis Andrus now to start the inning for the Rangers. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground towards short. Throw to first in time, one gone here in the fourth. Josh Hamilton will stand in. and turns on one and launches this ball out to deep right field. Backing up is Batista, but he'll have no chance at all. This ball is gone. It's a solo home run off the bat of Josh Hamilton, number 22 on the year, as that'll give the Rangers a 2 to nothing lead. Adrian Beltre will try it again. Here's the ball hit pretty well and carrying to deep right. Bautista is right there, and that's out number two. Nelson Cruz will dig in here. One. Yeah, that looked to be borderline at best. Here's the ball hit high in the air and fairly deep toward the right field corner. Bautista is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire. Adam Lind will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. L job behind the plate, too. He sort of gently moved that glove back over an inch or two as he was catching that baseball. Swing and a high pop-up toward the stands behind third. And this is taken in by Beltre for the second out. J.P. Aaron C.B. He's all over the place right now. I mean, his mechanics have called the cab and left the ballpark. And this one misses high for ball four, and they have themselves a two-out base runner. After patience is the runner at first will get a head start on three and two. And he misses again, ball four. And that's back-to-back -back guys now that have reached. He's ready now, the pitch. Swing and a line drive to center field. And that's in there, base hit. And he'll be tagged out heading toward the plate. And with that, the ending is... Mitch Moreland will start things out on its way. Swing, hard hit ball to second. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. Michael Young will stand in. He grounded out his first time. Now a swing and a ball pulled down the line to third. On to first, and Young is retired here, two away. Mike Napoli will dig in here. Pitcher, 
Throw the change up and he'll be even more out in front. Out in front here as this is pulled down the third base line. Uh, throw not nearly in time, so despite the great effort, that'll go into the books as an infield single. David Murphy will stand in. Picked up the velocity here the last two pitches. Now a swing and a fly ball hit fairly well out to deep center field. Goss will get under it, though, and he puts it away to retire. Number 15 will step in. Pitch. And he swings under the fastball here as this is popped high in the air back behind short. And Andrus will take this one in with two hands for the first out. Anthony Goss will try again. Struck out swinging his last time. Struck him out as his woes continue as that's his third strikeout of the game. Yunel Escobar will dig in now. Hit and this one misses inside a ball he walked in, and they've got themselves a two-out base runner. Jose Batista will dig in now. Behind to be forced to come in with a fastball. And he may be starting to lose the feel here as that misses for ball four, and that's back-to-back -back walks now with two away. Adam Lind. Big swing there as it's hit pretty well out toward deep left field. Murphy has to retreat to the track, but he has it to retire the side. Ian Kinsler will get things loose. Swing and a little tapper out in front of the mound. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Elvis Andrews will stand in again. A couple of ground outs for him on the ledge. And he looks at ball four now, so he's aboard, and you always have to worry about the threat of the steal when he's on base. Josh Hamilton. You want to set that runner in motion here. There goes Elvis. And this gets past him at third as it hugs the line. A fair ball. Now here comes Blue Jay skipper John Farrell on his way out to the mound. And he's looking to the bullpen here, so it would appear that's all for his starter tonight. Jason Frazier will come on and try to... Now a swing and a high fly ball, and this one has some carry on it to deep right field. Bautista is there, and that should be deep enough to score the run. Nelson Cruz... Now a swing and an easy fly ball out toward right center. Bautista is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Travis Snyder will get us going for the Jays here as they start their half of the sixth. All right. That was in a tough spot. Now here's a slow grounder to the left side. Bare-handed by Beltre. Throw in the dirt, but a good job of staying with it that time as he's retired. J. Pierre and Sibia will stand in. Base on balls his last time. Swing and a line drive to left. But pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Mo Sierra will stand in. Base on balls his last time. He's seen the count move from 0-2 all the way to 3-2. And, and this is taken low for ball four, and they'll have themselves a two-out base runner here after all. He didn't even have to worry about chasing. And he struck him out his seventh of the... Stephen Pryor will come on out of the bullpen as he'll be appearing in his third game this season. Mitch Moreland will stand in here hoping to duplicate what he did back in the second inning as we flash you back to take another look at his solo home run that helped get this offense rolling. That fastball's right there. Swing and a ball hit fairly well, heading high and deep toward right center. Goss is back, though, as he makes the catch for a long out number one. Michael Young will stride forward now. He's bounced out a couple of times already. Swing and a shot toward right center. And this will get down out there. Should be extra bases for Young. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. Mike Napoli. And he gets some pretty good wood on it here as this is lifted to fairly deep left. Snyder back to the track as he takes it for out number two. 
The tag at third, and they got him. A double play, and very quickly here. Mark Lowe will come out and take the ball here as he'll be making his 15th appearance of the year. Number 15 will dig in. 0 for 2 thus far. Guy and maybe get a rally started. Hit on the ground is shortstop. On to first with it is Andrus, and it's in time, one away. Anthony Goss will stand in, and they've done a good job keeping him off base is on deck. But he takes ball four, so he's on, and as you know, that often means the steal could be in order here. Yunel Escobar will step in now. Runners going. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. Not in time as he steals second. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. Jose Bautista will stand in, but with the tying run still in the on-deck circle, that's two and two. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Casey Jansen will be summoned from the bullpen now as he'll take over to start inning number eight. David Murphy will step in to lead things off for Texas. It's all about putting a guy back on his heels to begin the at-bat. Now a high bouncer toward the hole. And he'll flip it to the pitcher covering for the out. Ian Kinsler will stand in, and they've done a good job keeping him off base. This is hit sharply to the left side, and this will be a base hit for Kinsler. Elvis Andrews will stand in here. 0 for 2 with a run scored so far. Now a fastball that stays straight, but I think he just missed it as this is hit in the air to fairly deep center field. Goss is back, though, and he's there to put it away, two down. Josh Hamilton will dig in. He homered back in the fourth. Now here's the first pitch. Swinging a hard-hit ball back up the middle, and that's through into center field, base hit. And the run will come across to score from second, and they open it up to 4-0 now. He won't oblige either time. And Beltre swings and hits this one in the air, but I don't think he got all of it. Goss is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Craig Gentry is into the ballgame now as he assumes duties in center field. Robbie Ross is on out of the bullpen now as he'll take over to start the bottom of the eighth. Adam Lind will lead things off here in the bottom half of inning number eight. Now a swing, and he pops it foul behind the plate. And there to take this is Napoli for the first out. Travis Snyder will step in, a ground out victim his last time. And he got him. J. Pierre and Sibia will Now here's Aaron Sibia with a drive. High and deep out to left. And that ball is out of here. A solo shot here to left. Eighth home run on the season for him. As they get on the board, it's 4-1 to one now. Mo Sierra will stay. Mike Adams will come on here looking to get the final out in the home half of inning number eight. Him again. Now a swing and a ground ball. And not too shabby out of the pen. Takes just two pitches to get the ground ball. And then... Sergio Santos will come on now to start the ninth inning as he looks to keep this deficit right where it is for the bottom of the ninth. Nelson Cruz will get us started as they look for a little insurance. And maybe an excuse me swing there as this is tapped in front of the mound. And they still manage to get an out on the play. Whoa. Mitch Moreland will stand in. He homered back in the second inning of this one. Swing and he pops him up. Behind the bag at second. There to take it is Escobar. Two away now. Michael Young will get another crack. And he gets him to lift one high in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Escobar has got it, and the side is retired. So they go down. 
Your attention, please. Safe situation here, so they'll hand it over to one of the best in the business, right-hander Joe Nathan. Kelly Johnson will get another shot now, two for three in the game. Swing and a miss, and that'll get a groan from the home supporters here, one away. Number 15 will stand in, needing to do something here. Got to make this guy swing the bat here on this next pitch. This is not the guy you want to lose. And he takes ball four, so a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base. And he'll strike out here yet again, as it's been a ball game to forget thus far. Four strikeouts. Last chance now. On the ground down the first baseline. And this is by Moreland and down the line, a fair ball. Throw will hold that runner at second, so there are two on now with two away. Jose, but that's a good take. You won't do much with it when it's located there. Throw on to second for the force, and the ball game is over. Well, this ball club showed me a lot tonight. They really put their nose to the grindstone and came away with a hard-fought victory on the road. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our top player of the game.